Hey guys, it's Rybro, I'm bringing you my vlog number two. Uh, I apologize about the quality of this video. Um, I've been really busy, my kids have been bonkers, I, and I haven't been able to do the video like I normally want with my regular cameras and microphones, so I'm stuck using my phone. Uh, but I really wanted to make this video, so this is how I'm doing it. Um, so I'm going to really suck for the next several weeks and maybe month I, I really don't have a clue uh so basically a week ago i made the decision that i was no longer going to drink until my son's second birthday which is in june june 5th uh <clears throat> the reason for this decision is not because i'm an alcoholic or anything like that it's because after state darts i kind of reevaluated where my dart game was and you know, as one of my friends put it, alcohol is 100% a crutch for my game. I cannot throw at my best unless I have a certain amount of alcohol in my system. And this isn't uncommon in the dart world. Uh, I would say it's a pretty high percentage of players that say, that probably can't throw their best without a little without a few beers at least so you know after state i basically was having to drink like during state i was having to drink oh man 10 15 beers it's pretty bad before i even felt comfortable on the board and when i got home after that week i just said that's so ridiculous you shouldn't you know you you shouldn't have to rely on that much alcohol to throw decent darts. And, you know, on stream, I like to drink a few beers. Um, I have a few before the stream. Um, I understand alcohol is just kind of part of the culture of darts, but, I, you know, I have some friends that went the sober route, and their dart game improved a lot, and they're way more consistent. Um, I know other people in the chat the other night were mentioning that they did the same thing and their game has improved and is way more consistent so i'm making that decision um so i'm going to try to do it until june it's going to be weird it's going to be hard so i apologize about the stream because there's going to be a lot of really low low average games i think my highest last night was only like a three maybe i don't even know if i broke a three last night i you know, it's it's hard. Um, it's a new hurdle for me. I've never experienced this before. When I started darts, I was in a bar. I was drinking. Um, I've always played darts with alcohol around me. And so now it's, you know, the mental aspect is difficult because hitting a simple shot is just say I have to hit a fat 16 you know, that is such an easy shot or have to hit a couple bowls. That's an easy shot. It's so hard. <laughs> These past two streams, you know, I've looked at them, but I can't hit them. And, it, and so there's that mental aspect, you know, this isn't, it's hard to compare it because, you know, there's, there's times when you have bad nights. So take those times when you have bad nights and multiply it by 10 and it happens all the time. That's what it feels like. Um, so that mental hurdle is going to be very difficult to get over for me. And then the other aspect to it is my muscle memory. I've always had beer in my system when I play. So my muscle memory is so um, tuned into that. So now how do I convince my hand that you do know how to throw the darts? Yes, you're sober. But how do you, how do you bridge that? So these next few weeks to a month, whatever it's going to take is going to be a little painful to watch. I, I apologize. I'm going to try to hold my frustrations back as much as I can. Um, but um, besides my dart game, hopefully improving at the end of this, you know, obviously it's, it's good for the body. It's good for the health. Uh, save money because you're not buying beer all the time. Uh, so there's a lot of upside to this, um, but I, I'm really hoping the dart game improves i'm really hoping i come out on the right end of this um, from what i hear most people do so i appreciate everybody that's continued to tune in and watch the past couple streams and who have thrown some support my way that's pretty cool 
I do appreciate that. So, um, with that being said, I, I don't really have much else to say. I just wanted to kind of explain why there's a severe drop off in my game, and and th that's why. Um, so I'm. It's going to be an interesting journey, and uh, a painful one, a struggle, but hopefully very rewarding in the end. Uh, so with that being said, you know, again, I appreciate everybody that tunes in and watches that likes and shares, you know, that's active in the chat. That's, that's awesome. Um, keep it up. And, you know, without you guys, I'm, I wouldn't be doing this stream. Um, as long as people are tuning in, I'm going to continue to do it. And as long as it grows, I'm going to continue to do it and continue to give things away. So otherwise I got nothing else, guys. This is just a, a quick, uh, vlog and just wanted to, you know, kind of, get those thoughts out of my head and out to you guys so you kind of knew what was going on. So hopefully everybody has a really good rest of the Sunday.